It's bright enough, as bright as it's gonna get today. What's up, Faith Squad? Duh. What's up, Faith Squad? Happy Thursday, y'all. Excuse my voice. Disclaimer, a few disclaimers. Please excuse my voice, y'all. This cold, it just won't shake. I'm trying, y'all. Excuse the uh, Merry Christmas I ain't took down yet. And excuse my absentee, y'all, but we're going to get into that after we get into this prayer, and I'll tell y'all what we having. Um, I appreciate all y'all that's still been rocking with me due to my absence, and you know, because you know, if people don't see you, they'll leave you. So I just want to let y'all know how much I really, truly appreciate each and every last one of y'all that's still riding and rocking. Um, today, we having some Chinese food, y'all. It took me over two hours to get this food. They came and then came to the wrong address, and they had to come back. And I like this Chinese place because it's close to me, and they food be fresh and good. So they can finally came back, so it's hot, so I want to eat it while it's hot. Um, I got some uh, sweet and sour chicken, some white rice. I got some crab ragoons. Let me see. I got some veggie egg rolls and some sweet and sour sauce. And I also got a bag full of soy sauce and stuff like that. And I'm drinking some strawberry lemonade. So we're going to get into a prayer, y'all. And we're going to get into this. And we're just going to have a little chit-chat today. Let y'all know what's been going on with me. Most gracious and heavenly Father, we thank you, Lord. Lord, we just thank you for another beautiful, blessed day of living life, Lord Jesus. Lord, we ask you to touch anybody's family and friends who didn't make it today, Lord Jesus. Touch their family and send them some comfort, Lord, and let them know that they are in a better place. And for whatever reason you seem fit to call them home, Lord, just know that, that, that you will send them comfort, Lord. Lord, I ask you to touch my family and friends near and far. Let them know that I love them, Lord, and I'm continuously praying for them, Lord. Lord, I ask you to touch the YouTube community, not just the mukbang community, Lord, but the whole community. Um, just touch everything that you see that's going on, Lord. I really don't need to get into detail because we all know that you know. And at the end of the day, you're the only one that's going to be able to fix it, Lord Jesus. I ask you to just continue to be a part of my life, Lord. Continue to keep me peaceful and, and just keep negativity from around me, Lord Jesus. And... If it is around, Lord, just continue to protect my mind and my heart and my soul and my mental, Lord Jesus. I thank you because that's exactly what you've been doing, Lord. I owe it all to you and nobody else, Lord Jesus. And I just want to continue to do your will and your way. Lord, I thank you for forgiving me for my sins, but knowing my heart, Lord. I thank you for just not judging me, Lord, because you know that we are not perfect, Lord. I thank you for knowing that I'm working on me, Lord Jesus. And with, with all the love and compassion and things that you have died upon that Christ cross for us, Lord. I feel like we owe it to you, Lord. And I just want to thank you just for being a part of my life, Lord. I ask you to touch anybody going through any financial situations, anybody that needs any health, you know, just anybody that's going through any health issues, Lord, any mental, physical, or emotional things, Lord. Because some people don't know how to, you know, open up and talk about it, or they just don't want to, Lord. So I ask you to be the voice right now, Lord, wherever it is that they may be, and just tap them and let them know that as long as they have the faith the size of a mustard seed, Lord, you vow to never leave or forsake us, Lord. And I just love you, and I ask you to let this food be a nourishment to my body. In Jesus' name, amen. So yeah, y'all, I hope everybody's doing well. I appreciate all our new family members. Um, I wanted to um, ask all the new people that's new to please uh, leave me a comment that says new, hashtag new, and also let me know how you found me. And that's because I would like to give y'all a shout out. And to all my loyals, my day ones, my A ones that I know going to ride with me regardless, I appreciate y'all so much. I love y'all so much. And I just ask y'all keep me in y'all prayers. Now, and like I said, we got some sweet and sour chicken, some uh, crab rangoon, and some veggie egg rolls. Where do I want to start, y'all? I'm starving. I ain't ate nothing literally all day. All day. Of course, you know I got to give y'all beautiful people the first bite. Hope y'all like it with that sweet and sour sauce. 
But yeah, y'all, um, uh, I had put up a post and let y'all know that my phone that I normally record on, where is it? Mm. Well, I was finished with y'all, but it won't come back on. I can't get it to turn on. I've been having issues with it for months, but, you know, it was, it was working in my favor. So, this phone that I'm actually recording on now, I'm surprised it's letting me record. But I guess because I had restarted it, but it's cracked up and stuff. So, I'm working on a phone, basically, y'all. And I wasn't going to record because I don't like the quality of it. I hate that when, when I watch videos of people that's dark and I can't see them. So, I'm praying that this video come out right, y'all. And if it don't, forgive me, but I feel like I owe y'all a video. Mm-hmm. Mm. It's fresh, y'all. But... Okay. Y'all, it ain't no secret that we all see what's going on in the YouTube community. And I'm just speaking for myself and why y'all haven't seen me because it's heartbreaking, y'all. It is. It's discouraging. And I almost, I almost felt like I didn't want to be a content creator no more, y'all, to be honest with you. Because it really leaves you... And the man, especially when you already got stuff going on and you come to YouTube to try to have a place that you call your own, a place where you can love people and people love you back, a place where, you know, we know the trolls going to say what they say, but you think people won't judge you or you, you know, you just want to, you feel like you got a community of people that even if we never met, we just can love and support each other genuinely and Mmm, that's hot. Mmm. Oh, them hot, y'all. And y'all, it's just heartbreaking to me, and I know some people may look at me and think, oh, she's tough, or woo, 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 but I mean, I can hold my own, you know what I'm saying, but when you got a caring heart like I do, a giving heart, and your loyalty is questioned, or you know, you feel like somebody don't trust you, or you know, you just feel like you don't know who to trust. Then you know, it's it's it. My nerves are shot, y'all. I'm plus it's cold. I'm freezing over here, but it's just heartbreaking, and it just make you feel like, you know, you're just looking at everybody like, really? But I just want to stay. I just want to say and try to encourage everybody to. Stay in your own lane. Do you. If you enjoy doing YouTube and you, you know, you got people that you rock with or you like or whatever, that's cool. But just don't put your all into it. I mean, I, I, I've i met, since I've been on YouTube for two years, I've met two people, like physically met, been in my home. And that's two families, Key Cam and the fam and Prissy P and her husband and it was a joy, and I got video. It's videos out there to prove it. Um, it's a lot of people involved in the stuff that's going on that I love and support. My girl Tosh Time, y'all already know. I love and support her. She love and support me. Tosh Time has had my back on many times. Tosh Time has blessed me many times, and it's just sad because I I understand like where she when she says that her lack of uh, trust. You know, she's she don't know who to trust or whatever. I respect that, but. I ain't gonna lie, it got me feeling some type of way because I never had that happen to me. Like, I never had nobody that I consider a friend or or whatever associate. And me and her have never even met. She's, she invited me to the, uh, she invited me to the, um, trip and everything that happened in Houston and everything. But I'm scared to fly, y'all, so I didn't go, but. My point is, you be kind of feeling like you in the middle. You know what I mean? Like, you got to pick a side, and I ain't doing it. Until somebody cross me, I can't pick no sides. I can't do it. And I, it's just hurtful, y'all. It's really been having me, like, literally not even wanting to upload. But I have had so many people hit me up, checking on me, wondering where I am. 
let me know that they love me. Nothing to do with the mukbang. Basically, that they miss us. You know what I mean? Me and the kids or whatever. But y'all know I started this channel because I can't comment on my old channel. Can't go live over there. But I'm still going to be producing stuff over there. So my whole point is I just wish and pray. And that's all I've been doing, y'all, to be honest. That this whole situation get fixed because it's got everybody looking at everybody certain kind of ways. I know it do. It don't take a rocket scientist to figure it out. But like I said, I understand that and I respect everybody's choices and everybody's decisions. But when I rock with you, I rock with you, period, point blank. That's just all I got to say. You know what I'm saying? When I love and support you, especially, you know, when you love and support me and my nieces and nephews and you speak so highly of us and you support us and show us love and Yeah, I was so hurtful. I didn't even want to talk about this, but I just wish and pray that it can get back to how it was when I first started YouTube, y'all, because <laughs> YouTube is therapy for a lot of people, whether y'all know it or not. Do y'all know how good it feels for somebody to hit you up and let you know that your video, your conversation... Your prayer, your yo, your realness, yo, you being you. And these are strangers. They never met me. But they recognize you even through a screen. And I know people say that, you know, don't be fooled by people over the screen and all that stuff. But different strokes for different folks, y'all. I am who I am. Who you see here is who you gonna see when you meet me. Mm. And you can ask the people who met me. But it just breaks my heart because YouTube was fun, man. Y'all, I used to get a joy. You hear me? I used to couldn't wait to upload videos, man. I'm telling y'all. And for all my new people that's over here, y'all, please go subscribe to our old channel because I am going to be still having that effect of whenever I just get my mojo back, y'all. I promise I am. But I also want y'all to go and check out the new channel so y'all can get to know us better. Because I know y'all probably like, who is us? <laughs> and when I say us, I'm referring to me and my nieces and nephews. They are all over the channel. But YouTube didn't got so strict and so petty. That's why I don't have no comments now. That's why I can't go live now. So I try to I really haven't been putting them on there, but am I going to keep them off? No, I'm not. I'm definitely going to put them on there. Just on the old channel. I'm going to keep this channel with just me and probably just mukbangs and everything else I'll do over there. I'll cook over there. I'll vlog over there. I'll, uh, anything else that I do, because we do a little bit of everything, y'all, but i just really trying to get my mojo back, and I can't sit here and promise y'all and let y'all know when that's going to be, but I do feel like I owe y'all this video. And I just wanted to voice my opinion on the things that's going on because I haven't been in nobody's live stream that's been talking about none of this stuff because I choose not to. You know, you got to protect your energy sometimes. And some stuff you just need not to speak on. And God been working on me. And he done helped me not to spaz out and not to be upset. And, you know... I was upset when I heard about what was said about me or whatever, but I forgave. Because God said you got to forgive. I forgave and I keep it moving. You know what I'm saying? I was real hurt because I loved and supported somebody. And no, I don't have no receipts, but I just feel like the person ain't going to sit there and just make it up. Why would they make up something like that about me? Why would they come and go out of their way to not even go out of their way because they didn't want to tell me at first because it was so hurtful, but I appreciate them letting me know. Because imagine sitting and supporting and loving and rocking with somebody who don't rock with you. Or or even if they do, would name call you or whatever in case. Y'all, I don't even want to talk about that. My whole point is I'm letting y'all know that it has affected me. I ain't weak. Don't mean I'm weak, but it means that I'm human. It means I have feelings. I have emotions. It means that when you push so hard to support people and don't ask for nothing back but the same love and support... 
And, you know, you just, I just don't like my loyalty to be questioned, y'all, because I'm too loyal. And I got that tattooed on my chest for a reason, by my heart next to my brother and my stepsister and my granny. All three of these people on my chest, if y'all ever see my tattoo, are in heaven and they watching down over me and they protecting me from all of this along with God. And I just can't give negativity my energy, y'all. I'm not perfect. Y'all probably done seen me lash out or something like that, but it ain't been no crazy stuff. Y'all ain't seen it. And I don't want y'all to because that's not the person that I am. Look, I can't even eat my food. But I really just wanted to come on here because I know I got a new, lot of new subscribers. And I know y'all probably came from my name being mentioned in the drama. But that's why I ask y'all, please let me know in the comments below that you are new because regardless of how you came, I hope that you at least go over to the old channel because we only get this will be the third video on the new channel. But go over to the old channel and check out the playlist, y'all. I got scripture readings. I got grocery hauls. I got vlogs. The kids got pranks and challenges and stuff we did, y'all. It's just a lot of positive content over there. And I will really appreciate it if y'all go and check it out and then come back and let me know. You know what I'm saying? Y'all might have some questions or something. I don't mind answering questions for y'all. Get y'all some of that Craig Rangoon. I don't mind answering questions for y'all. Just don't get disrespectful and don't try to get too personal. What? That's what I wanted to come on here and say, y'all. And for and I know it's affecting a lot of people because they don't let me know, or they don't let me know that they notice that, you know, they haven't been seeing me uploading it. You know, when people genuinely support you and love you and look forward to your videos, they want to know what's up with you, so. But like Key Cam and, Fa and the family, you know I'm saying, today in Tosh Time Live that the devil won't win this. He won't. He won't because we got too many great people involved. We got too many people that are really, really genuine people. Like, I love Tosh Time. I love Prissy P. I love everybody that's involved in this. Everybody that's involved, I don't have no bad blood with. I don't dislike nobody, y'all. Now, people might dislike me, but I don't know it. But my thing is, if you know you don't like somebody, just stay from around them. You know, you don't have to be around them. You don't have to support them or any of that. You see them and you don't want to speak, don't speak. You don't have to, period. You grown. But just don't... You know, I don't know, y'all. It's just, I just never expected none of this to go on. That's why I left Facebook three, four years ago. Too much drama, negativity, and a whole lot of lies. People lying like you don't know who they is because they on Facebook. Mm -hmm. I just don't do good with conflict, y'all. I don't do good with conflict and drama because I, I, I changed that part of my life. That was in my 20s and stuff. I'm about to be 40, y'all. I'm a grown-ass woman. I ain't on that. Excuse my mouth, y'all. I'm sorry. But it's just really have affected me, and I don't like it because I enjoy YouTube. I really love watching y'all. Even when y'all don't see me comment, and I'm watching y'all on my TV right here, right now, I be watching all day long. I turn cable off because I'm a YouTuber. I'm a content creator. And it's just heartbreaking, man. It makes me so sad and so mad, but I gotta change that mad into prayer, y'all, because y'all don't know. These last couple weeks, it's been so many times I've been wanting to get on here and push play and just spaz out, but that is too draining for me. It's too draining. This whole situation is draining. It's taking my energy. I'm watching so many people hurt so many people lied. I mean, it's just, oh, it's so sad, y'all. But you know how I know that it's crazy because the devil steps in and it's kind of, it, it reveals, people reveal stuff, y'all. They reveal so much stuff when they're angry and hurt and mad. And it just really, really, that's the part that bothers me the most because it makes you feel like, damn, you been have you been feeling like this? Or rather about, you know what I'm saying? You just... I ain't no fool, y'all. I can read between the lines and stuff, and it just it's heartbreaking. And I'm just going to keep praying about it. And I just ask y'all all to keep me uplifted in prayer, y'all. I really, really do. And just know that I'm praying for y'all 
whether you're a content creator or not. Shout out to everybody that's not a content creator, but come on here and support us wholeheartedly and strongly. And they affect it bad. Yeah, I see it. They are really affected bad. They are disgusted bad. They are heartbroken bad. And, you know, I don't know, y'all. I just pray to God that it, it get back to normal because I'm going to have to find something else to do with my time, man. I don't know, y'all. I just like to stay in peaceful places and stuff. Like, that's why I don't be all out and stuff. You know, I don't like going out to the clubs and bars no more like I used to and stuff. It's just too much negativity, y'all. I just don't have time for that. And life is too short. Y'all, life is too short. When you lose people in your life, it make you appreciate life more. When you see people just the stuff that this world has got going on and going through, it make you appreciate life more. It make you just want to thank God for a roof over your head when you see people who don't have a roof over their head. It make you, y'all, thank God every day for my struggle because it really strengthens me. Like if y'all ever listen to me in my prayer, that's a big part of my prayer because without your struggle, you would not know your strength. Like you wouldn't know how strong you can be in. People mistake emotional because you emotional as weak. That don't mean you weak. You just got a heart. You a caring person. Like, I mean, I don't, I'm not a, all big on astrology, but I'm a cancer. We are very emotional people. Yeah, I sit here and watch the little puppy commercials when they need to be adopted and be sitting here bawling, crying, ready to go adopt their last one of them, y'all. But I'm just saying that to say this because I really feel like I had to come on here and I will be uploading this tonight, Thursday night. It's going on 10 o'clock. I ain't got no schedule on this page right now, but I'm going to get it together, y'all. But that's why I just need y'all to just continuously pray for me and pray for this situation. And if any of y'all watching this right now, if you don't comment or not, please understand that I love you. I would never cross you if I say I rock with you. I rock with you. I would never talk behind nobody's back. I'm not a fake person. Anybody that been watching me that knows me. No, if I have a problem, I'm going to reach out to you. I've had problems and little issues with people. And they'll vouch. They'll let you know that I reached out to them and asked them, like, do we have a problem? Let's fix it. You know what I mean? Let's not. I, I don't want to have no problems. Especially not. not I just don't want to have no problems, y'all. I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't. But I don't know, y'all. I couldn't even eat right because I just really was on my heart. I was going back and forth with it. And I just got finished watching um, Keeping Up With The Joneses. She did a little video, and, you know, it's kind of affected her, too. And I love Miss T. And, you know, I left her a comment and let her know how I felt. And she was just, you know, she commented back and let me know that it, it, it brought emotion to her because she was like, I was wondering why I haven't seen you. She said, I know I haven't seen you because I knew, you know, basically that this stuff had you feeling some type of way. And it did, y'all. But I'm shaking it off each and every day because my God is awesome. And he loved me. And he don't judge me. And he know my heart if don't nobody. He do. So with that being said, y'all, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Share our videos, y'all. And once again, if you are new, please go subscribe to our original Faith Squad channel. We are at 3,600 over there, y'all. And we at 500 over here. It ain't nothing but God. And to God be the glory. And I just pray that if you are new and you came here thinking that maybe this was a drama channel, but you see that it's not that you go over there and watch some of them videos and get to learn to love us. I mean, you know, everybody ain't going to like us. That's cool. But I just feel like I only have three videos over here, so you ain't really knowing me. Go get to know me. And if you got any questions, leave them down below because y'all can comment now. I love y'all so, so much. And y'all already know who we riding with, baby. We riding with the angels. Peace, love, and blessings to you all. I ain't get no thumbnail.